guys, so I got a comment on one of my last YouTube videos asking if I could do a tutorial to play the Good Omens theme song. I've never done a tutorial before, but I really love the violin and Good Omens, and I want y'all to be able to play it. I think playing music to fandoms is like one of the coolest things you can do. I just want to say I'm not a professional, but I have been playing for 13 years, so if you see something that you disagree with, this is just how I do it. You can choose to take my advice or leave it. <laughs> All right, so let's get started. So I know in one comment, somebody said they don't read sheet music. Um, that's okay, I started out Suzuki method and uh, you start out learning by ear first. So if you played Suzuki method, give it a shout out in the comments. So I'm going to start, the first note of this is E. So the first grouping of notes that I want you guys to be able to do is now, I'm starting in third position. If you're not comfortable with third position, you could start on the open E and go E to D. It's a D sharp. But I don't like the way that sounds, and I think the sliding effect you get going down to the C when you start in third position is cooler. I don't know, I just like that. So I, I'll give you a close up on my fingers. This is really hard to do when you're filming it by yourself. So it's an E to D sharp, then down to a C. And then to an A. And then after that, it goes to an E. Back to an A. To a C, to an E. Again, if you're not comfortable with third position, you can go. And the second part of this is very similar to the first chunk. We'll call this chunk B. So it's, which is the same as the first part, but then you're going to. If you're not comfortable with third position, you can play this uh, in first position. And it's first finger. Okay, the third part starts on D. So we'll start on D, it's the same kind of pattern of D and C sharp. B, G sharp. It's similar, it starts out the same. And I shift into third position here. with third position, you can play this in first position. Okay, and the next part starts on A, which is third finger on the E string. It's pretty straightforward. A to G sharp. And then I go back to third position for this F natural and slide from the F to the D to a B. But if you're not comfortable, you can do it on first finger on the E string. And then back to the E, which I go back to third position for. And slide from the E to the C. And then back to D. To a G sharp. And then it's an 
A, but I, I choose to do it in third position so that I can do vibrato. Give it a nice. David Tennant's in this, so we have to give it some. Give it some oomph. <laughs> well, I hope that made like sense. I've never done anything like this before, and I, I want to in the future though. If you like this, tell me what I could do differently that would help you more. Because ultimately, I just want people to be able to play their favorite songs on the violin. Because this violin has given me so much joy and so many crazy experiences in my life. And I want like everybody else to be able to have those experiences. Play an instrument, man. It can save your life. All right, that's it. Um, if you like this, please give it a like and subscribe. And tell me what I can do differently next time. And I will see you next week.